right? The last Turing test simply evaluated for what a machine could say, assuming that what it could say represented its intelligence. Now that we're kind of approaching that moment where these AI models are pretty good, um, arguably they've passed the Turing test, or they, maybe they will in the next few years. The real question is, how can we measure what they can do? So I've proposed a test which involves them going off and taking a $100,000 investment, and over the course of three months, trying to set about creating a new product, researching the market, seeing what consumers might like, generating some new images, some blueprints of how to manufacture that product, contacting a manufacturer, getting it made, negotiating the price, drop shipping it, um, and then ultimately correct, collecting the revenue. And I think that over a five-year period, it's quite likely that we will have an ACI, an artificial capable intelligence, that can do the majority of that task autonomously. It won't be able to do the whole thing. There are many tricky steps along the way, but significant portions of that. It will be able to make phone calls to other humans to negotiate. It will be able to call other AIs in order to establish the right sequence in a supply chain, for example. And of course, it will learn to use APIs, application programming interfaces, so other websites or other knowledge bases or other information stores. And so, you know, the world is your oyster. You can imagine that being applied to many, many different parts of our economy.